Hey guys, welcome to Solo Dolo Sports Facebook page. It's been a minute, been pretty much been, you know, this page has all been about supercharger football, but of course that's not going all that great this year. So it's not that fun. So I'm going to tell you what is going on that's real fun. Reggie Wilson career mode. Um, Mike Cobbs, of course, career mode. Um, two things I'm going to get into this tonight. Um, playing with Reggie Wilson tonight, right now, and I'm playing with Mike Cobbs later for the Jaguars. But right now we are into Reggie Wilson career mode. If y'all know anything about this little series that I've had, I started a face of the franchise with Reggie Wilson as the quarterback. And Madden would put him in all kinds of weird uh, playoff scenarios. He would make the playoffs every year. we get booted out. I couldn't really play the whole season. And it was just a weird face of the franchise. is just too weird. So I decided to move him over into franchise mode only. And the struggle has been, can I get Reggie Wilson and the Minnesota Vikings into the playoffs? And the struggle continues. I said it. I, said, I promised. I said I wouldn't do another video like this until Reggie Wilson was in the playoffs. But given that the fact of just making the playoffs is such a such a unachievable such such a unachievable goal at this point, I said I'm gonna do this game. Plus, it gives me something to focus on versus focus on the supercharger right now, which is kind of depressing. Even though I felt like we should beat UTSA tonight. I hope so. Um, it's on Heisman. I'm not going to take it off Heisman, but, and I have some ideas, but this team may not be as good as previous Supercharger teams. I'm just trying to accept it and uh, get ready for next season. But hopefully we make a bowl game, at least I'm hoping. But I'm here with Mike Cobb. Well, forget all that. We're here with Reggie Wilson. Eight and seven. We're eight and seven, and if the playoffs were held today, we'd be in. We'd be the seventh seed. Problem is, we got to play the Niners, who are the number one seed. And I don't think that Madden, I don't think the AI is smart enough to rest their players because they're the number one seed, whether they lose to me or not. They're the number one seed. I don't think the Giants can catch them. I don't know if the Giants could catch them. I doubt it. Uh, they are, they, they, they could, they could, but I don't think they will, but they could, there's only like a game difference between them right now, so, they could, so here we are, and, uh, of course the best team over in our division, of course, is the Chicago Bears, we of course defeated them. So that's kind of helping us get into this playoff. We, we've beaten, I mean, the last four weeks, we've beaten, we had to face three of our division opponents, and we beat all three of them. We beat all three of them. In fact, we swept, I think we swept the Bears. Yeah, we swept them. We beat the Bears, we beat the Lions. For That was a crazy game. And I've actually played all the, pretty much all those games. I've sent some but earlier in the season, but I've been playing, trying my best to get this team into the playoffs. So here we are. We're going to have to take on the Niners on the road. You can look at stats, look at how the season's going, see how the season has gone. Picks have been a problem. I throw a lot of picks. I had to turn the interception slider down. I don't want to throw 20 picks. I'm trying my best not to do it. Madden is very hard on you throwing picks, but right now you look at Reggie, he's got about 30 touchdowns. He's throwing for about 4,600 yards, you know, 303 yards passing per game, a 90.8 passing rate, passer rating. Um, that's a key number there, only been sacked 36 times. But the offensive line that gets like hammered all that offensive line that just gets injured all the time. So we got the man, Dalvin Cook. He's having a fantastic season. 32 years old. 
Morale's boosting up to his 96. Superstar development. He is the man. Probably should get best running back in the uh, in the NFC for this performance. He got Offensive Player of the Week last week. He got Offensive Player of the Week two weeks in a row. Yeah, two weeks in a row he's been Offensive Player of the Week, which is helping him boost up his morale. He should get an award. Morgan Powers, of course, been the, been the backup sort of running back when he gets hurt because um, Dow Cook has been hurt. Superstar development. Pretty decent player. Helps me out a lot. And I got a fullback, Rudy Ziegler. I will definitely use him. I have used him for us to get those third and ones and stuff like that. I just go in and reach into the playbook and just pull up the goal line plays and start using them. I will use the fullback to keep drives going. Irv Smith had a great season. 111 catches, 1,300 uh, yards, 11 touchdowns. It's definitely been the man that I've, that I've gone to when things get rough. Um, definitely can count on him. I mean, I think I had one game where he, like, had a lot of drops, but those are rare. What's Teddy doing? Justin Jefferson, of course, is – I really like playing – playing – I like throwing this guy. He makes plays. Seventh year, LSU, superstar, 96 overall player. How about Mid Tremaine Win Mincy? He's been good. Tremaine Wincy. Normal player development, but he makes some good catches. And he's been we've had injuries in our receiving core. And I think he's helped out a lot. Getting these young players that are just that are young like this are, are, are is very valuable. Jared Rutherford from Oklahoma has been really good for for us. Star development, 28 years old from Oklahoma. Damn good player. Um, definitely has helped, uh, helped our offense a lot. Um, offensive line's been pretty good. They give up sacks, but to just give up only 36 sacks and these guys get injured all the time has been a miracle. Defensively, uh, you got uh, Shaq Jackson from Louisville. Superstar, 25 years old, 91 overall superstar development. Got 10 sacks on the season, so that's pushing him up pretty good. Um, 10 sacks. You got Danielle Hunter, of course. Been a star, superstar X Factor player, 32 years old. These guys have been able to, uh, these guys have been able to get a uh, pass rush. Get a good pass rush. And Robert Strong, a defensive tackle from UCLA. 27 years old. He's got five, about five sacks. So, line is getting pushed. Defense is not that bad. I think we could probably use some more interceptions. Marcus Milstead from Oregon sort of supplies that. 26 years old. Still young. Zone coverage is tight. Man coverage is, is needs work. <laughs> Good player, good player. As far as kicking, Fairbairn's been pretty good. Punting, wait a minute, punting. 46 is not bad. Um, if you have like way over that, then obviously your offense isn't moving the ball, which is a problem we don't have. I mean, if you look at it, Vikings have the number two offense in the league. Mostly because of the passing. But I think the running game is there too. But you look at the Browns, like they run the ball a lot. Almost like they do in real life. Texans run the ball. Raiders are real good at running it. Panthers. Steelers. Almost 2000. So we're, we're, we're rushing the ball good. I think our thing is like passing. We, we are pretty good at passing at the passing. And I think we're over about it, just about everybody in that passing yards um, thing. I think we're about over everybody. Defensively, Niners are in the top 10. We're sort of not at the bottom, like at the midpoint. Not that bad, but not that great. Conversions, 
Vikings are, that thing about top 10, 12, whatever. Yeah. Red zone efficiency, we're number two, which is damn good. We score the ball. How many uh, touchdowns versus field goals? 39 touchdowns, nine field goals. So we do real well in the red zone. Plus we got we got Cap, uh, Dalvin Cook. That's probably why. Uh, we're at least penalized team in the league. So that's good to know. Yeah, I'm pushing the, the uh, penalty sliders up. But they're not really, hasn't affected us. I know we're not good at turnovers. I know we're not plus anything. 49ers are plus three. We're probably way below that. That's why we're like eight and eight, eight and seven. Yeah, negative 17. That's why we're the last week of the season and we're still not in the playoffs because of that number. Minus 17, which y'all can't see because my big, uh, my freaking window's in the way. Mm -hmm. Sorry about that. Awards. Mm -hmm. um, Baker Mayfield is probably going to be the MVP. No Vikings. Check out the NFC, Offensive Player of the Year. No Vikings, Defensive Player of the Year. Shaq Jackson's on the list. Wyclon Smith might win that one. Offensive Rookie, Blaine Shepard. No Vikings, Defensive Rookie of the Year. No Vikings, Best Quarterback. Right now on the list, I throw a bunch of interceptions. Oh, yeah, I'm on the list. Reggie Wilson. Then you got, we're ahead of Russell Wilson. Reggie and Russell. <laughs> Reggie's above Reggie, Reggie uh, Russell Wilson. Okay. Cool. Running back, Dalvin Cook, Cook win, best running back of the year. We're definitely going to need him for this game. Can't believe non bar receivers make the list. They ought to have a best tight end, too. I never understand that about Madden. Have a list for tight ends, because Irv Smith would win that award. I don't get it, man. No Vikings, defensive line, Daniel Hunters. Looks like he's going to win that award. That's cool. Jaquan Smith, Shaq Jackson's on the list. Best DB. I don't think nobody from the Vikings. Oh, the Marcus Milstead did make it. Jeff Kuda, the right Byron Jones is going to get it. Best kicker. Uh, Fairbairn might get that. He usually does. He usually does. So we're taking on. We are taking on the Niners. I'm going to check something real quick. Check injuries. I don't think we got. An injury to a left, our left end, Raphael Clay. I don't even think he started. Or what did he start? He's a rookie. Did he do anything? Did he have an impact this year? Two solo tackles. Yeah, he's not. He's not. That's not a big loss. It's not that bad. She was on this 49er roster. Quarterback, uh, Matt, Matteo Galindo. Superstar X-Factor player. They're the best team in the league, so he's showing up and showing out. Halfback, Anthony Knowles from Auburn. We're way to the future, guys, so these teams are going to be weird. Teams are going to look weird, have weird players. Debo Samuel, of course, is, he's there. John L. Lewis, a superstar. Superstar X Factor, 29 years old. Having a great season. George Kittle still there. 33 at 99 overall. Still a good player. Tackle, Grayson, Dalston Davenport, 
Yeah, let's see. Mine well, don't look that great, though. Except for that guy. He looks great. Mike McClinchy. Star development, 32 years old. Left hand, Eric, Eric Armstead, superstar. That'd be a problem. That'd be a problem. <laughs> Nick Bosa, of course, is a problem. 99 overall. Ohio State guy. Yeah, I love that. Javon Kinlaw. Pearson. Highly rated players, though. Fred Warner, another 99 overall player. Silver 99 overall player. Uh, 99 overall defenseman. This might be a problem. Might be a problem. Harris, corners. Goodwill. They don't have the best corners, but as far as ends and linebackers, man, they're freaking loaded. They are freaking loaded. Michael Babinon. All right. Enough talk. Let's get into it. Can I finally get this team into the playoffs? That's all I need to know. Play offense only. Uh, okay, let's see here. Uh, boy, that sounds terrible. Xbox Series S where everything's fast. Everybody's game introductions took a while. Now they don't. We got rain. Why y'all playing y'all starters, man? You guys got this. I don't need to play. Well, Russ, I mean, I could be like, well, I'm not going to do a game until we're in the playoffs, but really, this is a playoff game. We don't win, we're probably not in. This is a playoff game. We are in. Got to do it. Gotta do it in a hostile territory. I think we can do it. Ah, uh, there go Bosa. Catch. Good. Good dump off of seven yards. Of course, I got the announcers off, so I don't have to hear them. I don't want to hear them. We got on 10 minute quarters, so this is fast pace. Lock! Lock! No, not enough! They blew it up. They blew it up. Jefferson, but it was covered. It was covered pretty well. Sometimes I'm not going to be able to run the ball like I did. 
starting to roll. Uh, let's do the let's do the uh, receiver uh, jet sweep. I wouldn't do this if the CPU was controlling it. I don't know how to shoot the gaps. You block. Oh! Did I get the first down? No, second two. And Eric Armstead is out. Someone I don't have to worry about. I really want to change the play to a throw. We don't have that in my autobus. So take this. No, no! Kinlaw with the tackle. Kinlaw with the tackle. I'm going to put it in the air. I could just do uh, Irv Smith and let him just, because Irv Smith's just been no, unstoppable. They yeah, give it to Irv. Rutherford could clear it, that'd be good too. Get it? And he does get a touchdown, Vikings! And the Vikings are up 14 to nothing, pending the extra point. <laughs> gotta, gotta, gotta reinstate that. Where now is your score, though? Gotta slow the game down a little bit, try to run the ball. Oh, yeah, I'm really successful in that. Ooh. That's some weird animation right there. Got five yards out of it, but that's some weird animation, man. Of course, the main thing is, okay, you're going to put all the logs, you want to make the playoffs. Do you want to get your main weapons hurt? Before you hit the playoffs. Covered that pretty well. That's exactly what I'm gonna do on this one. So I did in my last set on the last time I played. Use the fullback, get this yard. Give Dalvin some rest too. Get in there, get in there, he's in there. He is in there. Jefferson. 
exactly what I want to do again. It's wide open. What is this, man? What kind of defense is this? That was easy. I just gave it to him. First down, Vikings. Ziegler, man. Oh, yeah. I mean, you got... The coach gives you suggestions, man. But you don't usually have to follow them. I mean, because sometimes they'll give you plays that just... It just suck. So I gotta go in and get my own place. That actually makes some sense. Dalvin ought to get something out of this. Dalvin ought to get something out of this. And we do. That is a touchdown. Ah! Yeah, they switched everybody over. It's like, okay, I'm going to leave him my best running back. Good block by uh, Irv Smith. That was, that was easy. I just gave it to him. I shouldn't probably be running in the middle. We're going to run in the middle. Got five yards out of that. shameless plug um i understand some of you guys can't get a hold of these next gen consoles um especially the xbox series x i've been having my own sort of problems getting one because i want one for my uh, youngest stepson um but if you get the s you won't regret it I mean, as far as if, if you know as far as play it's really nice console man and that's another touchdown for Justin Jefferson. I shouldn't say another, but it's a touchdown for him. Vikings have come out on the road and showed up and showed out. All right. We just might make the playoffs just yet. We just, we must, we might make it. Series S. No, it's not 4K, but it really looks good. No! You saw it, Vincy! Where are you going? We're going to end up punting. We're going to end up punting. I need a safe play. None of this stuff. Something safe. Yeah, that's it. This is a dump off. We don't want to do anything crazy. We got the lead. Just got to go to halftime. Make it real simple. Throw. Rutherford. Just short. We're button.
And of course, if we do make the playoffs, if we do make the playoffs, I'm going to do every game of the playoff run for this series. I don't do it for Mike Cobbs because, well, I haven't been doing that. I usually just post what happens in those games on Facebook. But uh, for this one, since it's a really fast-paced series, I'll, I'll have to record the video. See, we hold them. We do. We got more so. You don't want to do nothing crazy, though. We have to leave. Don't want to go do anything stupid. Don't like throw a pick or anything. Oh, he slipped. Hey, that's the most unmanned thing I've seen, you know. It is the most unmanned thing I've seen. It is wet weather, it's raining. You should slip. It shouldn't be easy. It shouldn't be your, your receiver slip. That's that's what should happen. Oh. Xbox Series S console right now. I mean, it's hard to get anything. I mean, I'm glad I got this. I'm very happy I got it. Oh, that stop the clock to everything that could have went wrong just went wrong. Except I didn't throw a pick. Okay, cool. We're back on offense. They haven't weren't able to do anything. So we still got a good lead. Kind of what you want. Oh, we're on. They had a turnover. We're gonna do some more damage. Oh! Ah! scenario engine. I'm supposed to win. Good. I'm not I'm not faulting the engine. I just hate when it turns against you. <laughs> and it's like you can't do anything right. You throw like a whole bunch of interceptions. You gotta give Irv Smith a catch. Two catches so he can beat Zach Ertz uh reception record. Rushed by Dalvin. Zach Ertz. I mean, 
Company for Irv Smith to get a Zach Ertz record. Oh, they covered that pretty well. They covered that pretty well. I tried. We'll go back to you, bud. We will go back to you. There's the record. There's the record. Get up. You're not hurt. Okay, don't be hurt. Next gen stats. Erd Smith. Secured your playoff spot. Of course, it's only on critical field goals I actually do it. I use up the CPU and make the field goals for me. Field goals good. Defense has been doing good all day. And they're still doing good.
Defense still hold. They got powers in the game. Cook's still being in there. Took him out. Get it? Justin Jefferson? Don't go out of bounds. First down. What a game. What a game. Well, I guess I could keep Dalvin Cook in there. He might break one. I want him to get that Russian title. Let's go to fourth quarter, guys. Up 31-7. Vikings are going to go to the playoffs. Vikings are in the playoffs. I wonder if something else, since I'm in franchise, I wonder if I could just substitute Reggie and put someone else in. Let me check that. They did take Morgan Powers out. They did. Oh, I can. Oh, cool. I can rest. I can rest uh, Reggie. There's a long rest with Reggie, but I mean, since I'm in regular franchise mode, Reggie could get hurt. I never thought about that. Reggie could get hurt. Not in career mode, and not in face of the franchise. Oh, why come out that way? Ah, oh, I thought that was open. I'm about to see what a 69 overall quarterback can do. I might just be broke. Or I might just be safe. Just be safe. Got the lead. Take a field goal. Oh, almost got it. Yeah, I'm gonna kick the field goal. We got the lead. No. What are y'all talking about? No. No, we're kicking the field goal. I'm overriding that. Kicking the field goal. I guess I'll do it. Oh, that's low. Ah, I, I messed that up. No wonder I make the CPU do it. Because I suck. Niners put some points on the board. Game's still not over. Can I put Reggie back in?
First down. First down. Vikings. Three touchdown performance by my boy Reggie. First time. It took a while, man. It took a long time for me to say, hey, I got this Vikings team in the playoffs. Not with facing the franchise. Facing the franchise, they pretty much put you in the playoffs. I'm in the playoffs because I put the grind in. touchdown pass. This is sort of like a franchise for me, man. I mean, I didn't know that. I was thinking, I'm like, yes, this is like a franchise. I can take Reggie Wilson out the game and still play. That's crazy. Of course, we are punting. We got a nice lead. Beat the Niners on the road. They played their starters and still won the game. Won it pretty handily. So for the first time I got this uh, series yeah, back in the playoffs. Let's see who our playoff opponent is. We didn't even run the ball real well. We had 113 yards. Actually, our defense held their rushing yards down. <laughs> What a game, what a game for uh, Reggie, man. 19 for 26, 219 yards, three touchdowns, 73%, no interceptions, that's the most important thing, didn't turn the ball over. Dalvin didn't have a great game, but that defense is tough running the football, kind of knew it was going to be. They have 99, like overall 99 players on that team. Irv Smith, six catches, 80 yards, Greg Zaxert's uh, record. Touchdown for Justin Jefferson. Touchdown for Rutherford. All these guys showed up and showed out. Defense did its thing. Jack Jackson with the sack. Marcus Milstead with a pick. 
Aaron Barron did his thing until I messed it up by kicking the field goal. And we only punted the ball four times. Pretty neat, pretty neat, pretty good, pretty good. So let's finish this game. Well, that's the first time that's happened. I mean, usually when we get in these scenarios, I can count on losing. We actually won. We actually won. Nine and seven record. We're gonna find out in a minute who's gonna be our opponent. First, I need to see NFL records. Catches in a season. Uh, yeah, I hate when it does that. Catches in a season. Well, as far as Zach Ertz, yeah, that's tight end. They don't have tight end. Well, they do have tight ends, but they were saying about tight ends, not total receptions. Like, imagine, have a section for tight ends. That would be really, really nice. But they don't. 32 touchdowns from the season for Reggie. We're going to find out who is our next opponent, right? Now. We'll be going on the road against the Panthers. Let's look at the uh, playoff bracket. Niners versus the uh, Packers. It's us versus the Panthers. And it's the Bears versus the Falcons. Over on the other side, Jets, Ravens, Pats, uh, Texans, and my big head's in the way, but that is the Raiders and the Bills. Browns and the Giants now have the buys. So, San Francisco losing that game, cost them a buy. So, we cost them a buy. Take that. Let's see what we got here. Nine and seven records. That's enough to get us in. Top players, none of us. I'm sure one somebody would make it, like Reggie would have made it, but he didn't. Reggie had a good season though. Thirty-two touchdown passes is not bad, especially with all the interceptions I threw. It was crazy. All right. Uh, Panthers, who are they? Who will be our next opponent with the Panthers? Mitchell Trubitsky. Yeah. Who's now pretty old now, 33 years old. 10 years in his career. Mitchell Trubisky. They also have Drew Locke. Matt Sheffield. <laughs> and running back, Christian McCaffrey. Still there. Still a factor. 31 years old. Stanford. You know all about him. One of the better players in the league as far as halfbacks. DJ Moore. Nick Garcia. A bunch of guys I don't even know. Mostly it's Miller, who's like a 99 overall player. Tight end, Danny Batten, superstar. Superstar, 25 years old. Offensive line, Greg Little. Graham Bredesen. Lucas Tyler. Jake Harold. Harold. Johnny Hoffman. Defense, Henry Walker, Brian Burns, superstar, 92 mm -hmm. overall player. Mm -hmm. Ready at the six, ranked right in the league. Mm -hmm. Let's tackle Derek Brown, mm -hmm. superstar, Auburn, mm -hmm. the seventh ranked defensive tackle in the league. Mm -hmm. Outside linebacker, Quan Hunt, Joe Barn, Devon 
Dante McKee, Jojo Blanton, Dante Jackson, Randall Winthrop, the safety, Marion Boykin, and Manny Dupree, superstar. 23 years old in his second season. The seventh ranked strong safety in the league. So it'll be Reggie versus Mitchell Trubisky in uh, Richardson's first playoff game in I don't know how long, like three or four seasons ever since I started this thing. I had to go back and look and see that. But I'm not going to do it right now. Vikings are in the playoffs, guys. Reggie will will be back at y'all with playoff action. I will definitely be recording the playoff run. Hopefully, we can get some games in, and Reggie can, you know, do some damage in the playoffs. And you never know; could be in the Super Bowl. Could see Reggie Wilson in the Super Bowl. That would be cool. I thank you guys for hanging out with me for. Our Reggie Wilson, uh, career mode on Madden 21. I'll see you guys later for more uh, Vikings playoffs. When we take on the Panthers, see you guys later. Solo Dolo out.